part of uh, coming to Chicago, uh, being Archbishop, is being able to work with the wonderful Catholic schools that we have. Right. And recently, the Archdiocese of Chicago received uh, uh, an honor. Uh, three of our schools were named Blue Ribbon Schools oh. by the U.S. Department of Education. Wow. And our office for radio and television has a first-hand look at that here on this clip. Let's Great. watch. Good. Our tour of Blue Ribbon Schools begins at St. Juliana on Chicago's northwest side. Students at St. Juliana were treated to a dance party, complete with pizza and a DJ. Amid all the partying, it was easy to find people to brag about their school. My sons go to this school, mainly one of the huge reasons was that my husband went here. And it's a very big, St. Juliana is very big in our community and it means a lot to us. Um, I think we all stick together as a whole. It is a huge thing for our community. This is something that this community have worked for, they deserve, and it just means a lot because of the multi-generational multi factor. With hundreds of kids singing Go Cubs Go, one teacher capitalized on the obvious connection to her school. We're a hardworking school. We have a lot of uh, dedicated teachers, staff. The kids come to school every day ready to learn, um, expecting a new challenge with their technology, with their writing, with math, with interacting with each other, developing their faith. And uh, so just like the Cubs, many different people working together to make a winning team. That's what we have at St. Juliana. Our Blue Ribbon Tour continues in northwest suburban Barrington, where St. Anne's School celebrates a second Blue Ribbon, repeating the honor it received 10 years ago. A common theme with people we spoke with, community. While we celebrate as a faculty and as students and as a parent community, we really need to extend our thanks and our gratitude beyond the school and certainly into the parish community and of course the Archdiocese of Chicago as well. You really feel like family. This isn't too, too much of a big school where you have so many people, you're just lost, you're a small fish in a big sea, and it just makes it a lot easier on you and the teachers really, really care about not only your grades, but how you are doing as a real person. They are very servant-oriented. Um, each grade level within the middle school has a certain amount of community service hours that they are obligated to do. And for the most part, they go above and beyond that because they truly do like reaching out to the community. Our final stop is on Chicago's southwest side at St. Daniel the Prophet School. An afternoon assembly brings students, teachers, and alumni together for a pep rally to celebrate their success. When you come to St. Daniel's, it feels like it's a family more than it does just at any other school. And then as you get your Catholic education throughout your life, it's the same idea. It's not just a concept of somewhere to get your education. It's also about trying to build this community, trying to be a leader, trying to know how to work with others. Well, the Blue Ribbon tells our students, who are city uh, students, that uh, they could aspire higher. And uh, for us as a, a private institution, that our students are always inspired by the relationship with God, but also that they could aspire higher to be all that God would envision them to be. They've always come back and said that St. Daniel the Prophet gave them the foundation they needed to go out into the world and become productive, strong, members of our community and of society itself. And they've always talked about the structure we had and the love of God that we gave them and the guidance to move forward in the spirit of Christ. On the Blue Ribbon Tour, this is Jim Dish with photographers Mike May and Brian Brock reporting for Catholic Chicago. Uh, quite a, a national honor. And yes. in, fact, um, in fact, for us, that's, uh, that, that's, a, that's a, a feather in our cap, is it not? Well, it is, is because I also know that there is not a school district in the United States, whether they're Catholic or public school, that has as many Blue Ribbon schools as ours. And I think that's a testimony to our great school office, uh, to the uh, work that's done every day in our schools by our teachers, administrators, by our pastors. Uh, there's a great commitment here in the Archdiocese to education, and I think that that is something we should be proud of. It is, I, I think there really is uh, no better team than the one that we have yeah. in our school's office. They're second to none. 
they, they're out there every day, not only in terms of uh, making sure that they have the resources in our schools, but they're also doing things to turn around uh, difficult situations. Mm -hmm. They're working hard every day. They really are second to none. That needs, congratulations needs to be said to uh, Superintendent Rigg, yeah. to you as Archbishop, to the whole school's office. It's right. a wonderful honor. They do a great job.